Charlie Boy has been heavily criticized or attacked by APC members because he said Buhari's eight years looking better than Tinubu's 60 days in office, says Charlie Boy. Maverick singer Charles Ukuta, aka Charlie Boy, has asserted that the eight year tenure of the immediate past president, Muhammad Buhari, is looking better than the incumbent Bola Tinubu 60 days in office. Uh, in the 60 days. Okay. He made the assertion while reacting to the 500 billion naira for palliatives recently announced by the current administration. Daily Post records that uh, Tinubu revealed that his administration will share 8,000 naira each to 12 million vulnerable households to cushion the negative effect of the federal government's recent removal of wealth subsidy. Charlie Boy berated the federal government's for a marking eight per eight p a eight thousand naira per month each for twelve million suffering masses and allocating seventy billion naira for national assembly members who are less than five hundred. In a tweet on Saturday, he said, "Can somebody help solve this wahala? What kind of leadership will give us the suffering twelve million masses only eight thousand per month and allocate to lawmakers we no reach five hundred people seventy billion naira." How can King Buhari's eight years looking better than Agbado's 60 days in office? You wonder if there is hope for ordinary Nigerians, okay? So what is wrong in this kind of questions? Are this no reality that all of them are coming out to... Well, I think uh, everybody knows the truth. You can say whatever you want to say. One thing that is your, is your conscience. And the reality is said before the whole world. You can turn everything upside down. But one good thing is that your conscience and the reality is really dealing with everybody, whether positively or negatively. No, what he has said, because you begin to wonder, and that is how they were so shameful or shameless that they are telling us that uh, Obi promised 10 people 15 years ago, 50, uh, 10,000 naira, and Tinubu is giving somebody 8,000, and people are, are crying. And of course, you know, when they think they know how to talk, they always come to embarrass themselves. And people who are knowledgeable of the events said this happened 15 years ago. And he talked about 10 people. And those people, they needed about six to 7,000. And that was 15 years ago. What is the, the, the inflation rate as at that time? How, what were the, the amount of things, you know, the prices of things in the market as at that time compared to what it is now? You see that they don't have a... They don't, they don't have a shame. That is just how I can put it. Now, the question that this man has, is it not better? You know, when uh, Buhari came on board, Buhari, God forbid, though, that Buhari, this, any, any government will still be worse than uh, Buhari's, Buhari's tenor because it was a, a, a very disaster, you know, disastrous one at that. When Buhari came on board, he did not eat the, he did not eat the, the ground running by so making people to suffer. That was not how they, he did it. This suffering started this very day Tinubu came to office. What kind of a, a person is that? Now all this grad grad is say we have not seen all the policies that is making here and there that we're shouting all of the nobody is talking anything again that is eating the ground running. She would tell them say this one, this one get moral justification to do what he's doing. Really? <laughs> it's just unfortunate. The very first day he came on board, he started all the, the suffering, you know, multiplied. I hope Tinubu Mata will not kill this man. Person where you pass, you pass. Pass who? <laughs> now Tinubu the feeder, you know see on our life. He say, don't mind him. He's a typical Igbo with hatred and bitterness over their defeat. Really? You know, your win now. I'm sure you are, you are enjoying your win. Tinubu won. No, I'm sure you are enjoying it. I'm sure you guys are enjoying it. The question that the man asked, what is, is it not reality? Now, you don't see how now the reason. So you are putting uh, him wrong. I can see that uh, you enjoy slavery and suffering. And it's, your, it's their hobby. You can see it. And that's why they love this agri reward. How can somebody come all the way from where he came from? And he made the use of the of that same place. He made, he made them touts. Thugs all over the place. And is that how to empower people? Can you just imagine? Excuse me, did I did you just say Igbos are homeless? Really? <laughs> I know. Uh, it's okay. 
uh, stupid and homeless. Say he said homeless. Somebody said homeless people. So it goes homeless. He can be funny. Tinubu has nothing to offer. Buari is far better than him. Mm. Tinubu didn't win election. No. Mm. When are we going to face reality in this country? Is the man lying? That is a, good, a big question. Is the man lying? Is he lying? Okay, this man is ego man. No wonder. Okay. Uh -huh. Let him take his drugs. Now this uh, homeless touch me most. Make person they, they under house arrest and see the and see the homeless. I can't even see the difference between the two. Both Buhari and uh, Tinubu, they both mischievous and criminal minded. Apart from uh, being too old to reason streets. Hmm. It's like it's like that because of the because he has he's carried Tinubu for his head like a agigi bread. <laughs> they, they carry agigi bread for head. Well, it is the other way around. Mr. Papa Charlie, Oga Tinubu is on his way to becoming Nigeria best, becoming you know, and smartest president. <laughs> Can you just imagine? It is obvious that the man is an urgent brain surgery before things before things get out of hand. I advise the children to do the needful as soon as possible. <laughs> Your contribution has no direction. Who needs urgent brain surgery? Charlie Boy or Tinubu? That is why you have F9 in all your subjects. <laughs> okay. Mm. It is a big fat life. Buari was a waster. Wasted eight years of the country and destroyed many lives and property. Tinubu so far has shown focus, strong desire to unify the country and bring the country out of the poverty. Buari plunged the country into an usher also to the path of growth, development, and progress. And all of you don't, you are all over the place begging for. I have not eaten since morning. That is the order of the day. I have not eaten since morning as it creased under this buar, under this sinubu. Of course, they are best of the same feather, just like somebody, uh, best of the same feather, just like somebody said. Though I strongly oppose to 8,000 naira proposed to be given to 12 million vulnerable households by the Government of Tinubu has palliatives to cushion the effects of oil removal. Tinubu should drop the idea that is dead at its introductions. The 500 billion era could be used to resuscitate our refineries and bring down the high cost fueling. If employment could be created for the teeming unemployed people, thereby bring succor to the family of the considered poor family the better charlie boy could not be objective in his criticism of tinubu because he's a stooge of Oba, to abasanjo who is not interested in anything good tinubu did he failed in his efforts at mobilizing people against his electoral sources let it be sound and clear here to the old world the yorubas are in term with tinubu than obj he has never been in support of any yoruba progressive agenda and the tribe has known him for self-centeredness. If I see, you are even worse. You are even worse than the Tinubu and Obasan Jodem says. Hey, so at the end of the day, so because uh, somebody who is, is not, but you agree to what he said. So who is talking about Obasan Jodem and uh, whatever somebody win or somebody don't. We are talking of reality. You agree to what he said. And did he mention anybody? So because people are suffering, People who are suffering in this country, they are the, the ones that are suffering who did not even vote Tinubu. They are suffering. They did not talk because they did not vote Tinubu. Is that what you are saying? They did not vote Tinubu, but they are suffering. So because they did not vote for him, they should. They don't have the moral rights to talk. Because that is exactly what you are saying. Because Charlie Boy is affiliated to Obasanjo. What has that got to do? It's Obasanjo. Now you are suffering. Now, are you going to be calling Obasanjo's name? Are you going to be calling Obasanjo's name? So that is the reason why you two, you are not even. You don't have the moral to talk. <laughs> 